In this video, we're going to learn some of the peripheral nerves found in the upper limb. Up here, we can see our brachial plexus, which is one of our spinal nerve plexuses. It's going to give off five major nerves, of which we're going to learn four. The first that comes off right here is going to emerge from the brachial plexus and wrap around the humerus running through the armpit region. The armpit's known as the axilla, so we call this nerve here the axillary nerve. It's shown in yellow. So there's our axillary nerve. It's the first one that comes off. The second one that we see right here is the musculocutaneous. We're not actually going to have to know that one for lab, but you will have to know it for lecture. It's running into the anterior compartment of the arm. Our next one that comes off is this one. It's also running through our armpit region. This is the radial nerve. So we see it coming off here. It's going to run down and supply innervation to our triceps at the back of the arm region. And then it's going to run down through our forearm all the way down along the thumb side. So this entire nerve here is our radial nerve. The last two nerves we can see on the anterior side. Here's our elbow joint here. Here's the wrist down here. And we can see the thumb side and the pinky side. So running down the very center of our forearm, we have the median nerve. The median nerve travels all the way to the wrist and then runs underneath of our flexor retinaculum. This is the nerve that gets pinched in carpal tunnel because all of these tendons that travel through the flexor retinaculum, if they get overused and start to swell, they can compress that nerve. The nerve that runs along the medial side, which is the pinky side or ulnar side, is called the ulnar nerve. And again, we can see here's our pinky. So the nerve that runs along the pinky side is the ulnar nerve. 